Meanwhile, a member of Fargo South's production of the Laramie Project says she's being threatened after speaking out about her castmates earlier this week. Sarah Siqueiros told Fox News on Tuesday some students deliberately invited a hate group to pick at the play. Here's Fox reporter Shana Sager. Sarah Cicado sits in her Moorhead home today, also known as her new school. Before this week, Sarah was a senior at Fargo South. She was the lead in the Laramie Project and had recently come out as being bisexual. Then, though, her role in a controversial play turned into her own real-life controversy. My chest feels really tight in terms of, like, you know, you know, is it over yet? Um, what will happen next? Now, Sarah will only return to Fargo South for this weekend's performance of The Laramie Project, a play based off the 1998 murder of gay college student Matthew Shepard. At a matinee today, the school's assistant principal escorted her to defuse any arguments. After she told Fox News earlier this week, some cast members invited the Westboro Baptist Church to picket the play. I would probably regret thinking, you know, they weren't, you know, doing it for the right reason. This was not right. It, it was wrong, you know. But now I can say that I did something to at least stop it. Since then, Sarah says she's received hate mail via Facebook from classmates. Some wrote in defense of the students who invited Westboro, saying, you have to ruin their lives because of a mistake they made just because you want attention. How pathetic. A student is receiving death threats because of your little stunt, something high school students shouldn't have to deal with. If anything happens to them, you are to blame. Another criticized Sarah on a friend's wall, saying, deep down, I am a mother hen, and if anybody messes with you or any of my other babies, I will murder. Because but to Sarah's mother, some of the that. worst treatment has come I'm from school officials. Well, they're fueling that. They're making it even more unsafe for my child, as long as they remain silent or minimize the actions of these kids. Now, Sarah will be homeschooled, but she says she holds no grudges. I don't feel so alone right now. Before, just when it had started with, wait a minute, they're messaging these people, that's when I felt the most alone. Having learned from the message the Laramie Project intended all along. Shana Sager, Fox News. Westboro has announced it will not be protesting the play, which is scheduled to go on as planned.